Eric, thank you. There has been an incredible amount of support for Buffalo Bills player DeMar Hamlin, who collapsed during Monday night football. He is still in critical condition after going into cardiac arrest. It's unclear whether the game will ever be rescheduled. And it hit close to home for a UNC Greensboro basketball player who went into cardiac arrest during a practice a year ago. WFMY News 2's Grace Holland talked to him about his recovery. Oh, he's a freshman, isn't he? It's another half court conversation between athletic trainer Stephen Borchick and Kyrie Thompson. Thankfully, I'm able to see him every day. But Obviously, both really will cool. always remember what happened in UNC Greensboro's practice gym just over a year ago. I was sitting down there actually talking to uh, my Miles Jones and Pop or Randy Phillips. I walk away. Um, I'm probably less than. 30 feet away. And I laid down. One of our grad assistants who was standing behind the basket said, hey, Steven, something's wrong. And then uh, I just woke up in ambulance. What Thompson can't remember from that basketball practice is that his heart stopped. I remember um, shocking him twice, which means we did CPR um, before we got any intervention from EMS. Borchick estimates it took up to 12 minutes before Thompson's pulse came back and he was taken to the hospital. I didn't realize it was as serious as they said, but without that, I, the doctor said I would still probably be comatose or something, so it was just very important. His recovery came with a few changes. Thompson now has a defibrillator and he is not able to play on the team. I wouldn't be able to be where I'm at without the people around me and the people in my life to be there for me. So I'm just very thankful for them. And, uh, you know, like no matter what you're going through, it's always, it's always another side to it. On that other side, he's still a part of the team, cheering his teammates on from the sidelines. He's a very well-respected voice in the locker room and on the floor. He is able to still be here and, and still be a part of this team um, and still be a, a, a part of this world is, is really inspiring. It's the kind of recovery they wish for Buffalo Bills player Damar Hamlin, who remains in critical condition after his heart stopped during an NFL game. You know, I'm hoping that he's working towards recovery now, to be honest. Borchick says it's a reminder for all of us to learn CPR, know the location of AEDs, and be prepared to help.